Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Dave here from the Bear Pit TV and today we've got a Manchester City preview. We go there this Saturday in the early kickoff, 12.45 away at the Etihad. Now, this is a really interesting game for me because I think we've got to have two mind frames really. Do we go for it? Do we go and try and pick up all three points because we need to, we've got a point to prove, we need to bounce back? Or do we go there and try and nick a point? That's what I'm thinking at the moment. That's probably what Mark Hughes is thinking. He's probably got two different mindsets uh, going on at the moment, whether he goes for that all-important win to try and boost us up a bit, or whether he goes into this extremely tough game against a brilliant side like Man City to pick up a point. Now, we did win there last season with a goal from Mam Juve. Now, he could be looking to replicate that, as I said, but it, it is going to be an extremely tough game because Man City are on fire. They've got some incredible players, as we all know, of course. They've got an incredible squad. Um, and they're in the semi-finals of the Champions League, so they'll be looking forward to that. They're just on fire at the moment, um, and it's going to be an extremely tough game for us. But some team news, Zun Shaqiri will miss the game, which is a big miss for us. He's been doing quite well, maybe not recently, but um, I think this season he has shown his quality and what he can bring to the side. And I think down that right-hand side we will be missing him. So I'd assume someone like Mamjouf will come and just um, operate on the right-hand side for this game against Man City. He's got a hamstring injury. Uh, which means he'll miss the game this week. I don't know whether he'll be out uh, for a couple of games after that. But in terms of Manchester City, they've not lost in six games. And that the last time they lost was against Manchester United in the derby. So they're in some good form. They're in brilliant form in the Champions League. And they're in great form in the league as well. Last time out, 1-1 against Newcastle. Did slip up a little bit. But uh, the rest of the games, they've been scoring lots of goals. Uh, with two 4-0 wins and then a 2-1 win against Man uh, against West Brom as well. Uh, so they score a lot of goals and that man Sergio Aguero is on fire as well. He's scored in his last three games. So I think he is a man we need to look out for, obviously, as well as Kevin De Bruyne. Um, and also Raheem Sterling looking to come back into the side uh, against us, which could be uh, difficult um, for Jeff Cameron if he plays at right back because he's got a lot of pace. Um, he's good on the ball. Uh, and he does like to shoot quite a lot and take players on. And I think he could be a threat with De Bruyne on the other side as well. And Aguero down the middle, I think uh, that could be quite a lethal threat for them uh, against a defensive problem side like us. Uh, but one injury news for them, they've got Sami Nasri out of the game. Uh, he's got a knee injury, so he's out um, for this game. I don't know whether he's out for the Champions League, but he's definitely out for the game against us. Now, going on to the Champions League, that's a different point that I've been thinking about. Uh, recently and I want you to comment what you think as well do you think Man City will be looking forward uh, to the Champions League more than they will playing against us maybe that will go in our favour maybe they'll be uh, thinking about that game they'll rest some players and I know for them resting players is like putting our first team back out again but um, they could be resting some players uh, they could be looking forward to Real Madrid and that, and they could slip up against us here and we could nick something and that's what I'm going to go for for the score prediction, I'm going to go in nil-nil. I think we're going to nick a point. I'm being optimistic. Um, I'm going to go for it, and I think we're going to nick a point. I don't think we'll score. Um, I think we'll hold, our, hold ourselves very well, and if our defence um, somehow manages to do this, we'll keep a clean sheet. Now, that's hoping. Um, obviously, I, I think the best we can get is a point. I mean, if they do start scoring, it's probably a question of how many. Um but I'm going to go with a point. I'm going to be optimistic. Let me know your score predictions in the comments down below. And that was my Man City preview, guys. As I said before, let me know your score predictions. Uh, anything else to do with the game, let me know in the comments down below. And as always, like, comment, subscribe. And cheers for watching. Stoke City Weekly News, where we go through three of the stories that are floating about at the minute and speak about them a little. So going in straight into it, first one is Peter Crouch. Daily Sport have said he's set to leave in the summer. 